guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna review the new L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte 24 Hour Foundation. And this is how it looks like. And I feel really good to be back to my original review videos. So if you're new to my channel, hello, welcome. Please do subscribe and join the family. And now let's quickly move on to the review. This foundation has been there almost for three or four weeks now. I'm starting off with the packaging. The packaging comes in like black and skin tone packaging, really slick and really tiny. We get 30 ml of product for 999 rupees or 1000 rupees. And there comes 8 to 10 different shades catering to all the skin types. And I picked up my shade in 107 Fresh Beige. And on the back of the packaging, it says lasting demi matte finish, never dull, never flat. Okay, it says about the finish of the foundation is demi matte and it wears up to 24 hours and it gives coverage of medium and texture is air light. This foundation is also oil free formula and to be very honest, the foundation feels really lightweight on the skin. It's not like completely undetectable on the face like when I'm wearing it on the face but it definitely feels really lightweight texture wise this foundation has a really creamy texture like it feels really really creamy and it spreads really nicely but you have to work really fast because this foundation does dry matte really quickly coverage wise this foundation is of light to medium coverage i would say more on the light coverage it is really natural foundation and it is perfect for everyday use and about the finish it says demi matte finish but i would say on my dry skin it dries up really fast and it is absolutely flat matte in fact after application it immediately dries matte and on the touch it also feels really matte and me being dry skin this foundation grabbed onto my dry patches and it exaggerated those dry patches on the first day i wore this foundation almost for three hours and i could not really wore after three hours because this foundation was so drying on my skin and the weather was also a little bit drying outside so i could wear this foundation up to three hours because it was literally cracking on my skin so I could not wear it after three hours. And on the first day itself, I knew that this foundation is not for me. And I cannot really wear this foundation on its own apart from wearing it in the summers when my skin behaves a little more normally and not as dry. And I'm really sorry guys if you can see a little bit of this reflection because the sun is really going crazy. Let me try and pull the curtains. I'm really sorry about that. The sun was going really crazy, so I just pulled the curtain. So as I was saying that I can only wear this foundation in the summers when my skin behaves a little normally, like it has some oil so that this foundation can control the oil. But I found a way to wear this foundation even in the winters when the skin is a little bit dry. Actually, the winter is gone now in Mumbai, but even in dry weather or even in the evening or nighttime, I can wear this foundation just by mixing a little bit of the facial oil. And that's how I am wearing it today. Like right now, I am wearing this foundation with mixing with some facial oil. And the oil I have mixed in is from L'Oreal only and it's their extraordinary boosting oil. And I believe this oil is now discontinued, but I just mixed this oil because I had this one and you know L'Oreal L'Oreal goes together so that's why and today I am wearing this foundation on the face and I will insert the application part you can literally see that this foundation is of a light coverage foundation and wherever I needed a little bit of the coverage I did not use this foundation instead I used the concealer that I've used and I used my concealer to spot conceal those areas and by mixing some facial oil into this foundation definitely does not feel as matte on the skin and i will insert footage of wearing this foundation at its maximum hours like wearing this foundation up to its maximum time so yeah apart from that if you're someone who has a really oily skin then this foundation is just right for you because this foundation is really mattifying and it will not let your oil come through your face and uh, yeah if you are oily skin then this foundation is must for you and this foundation also may become your holy grail foundation so yeah and this is how my face looks after five hours of wearing this foundation 
uh, feels really dry on the skin I also got a little bit of the cracks around my mouth area but it was okay and this is how it looks after nine hours of application still very dry on the skin and to sum up this video i would say that this foundation is totally pro matte as it says in the packaging and finish wise it has more of a light to buildable medium coverage and not proper medium coverage and this foundation is more of an everyday sort of foundation because it does not give as much of the coverage and with some oil mixing into this foundation for my skin it wears up to seven to eight hours after that i did not really test this foundation and i think eight hours is a really good time to understand if our foundation is long wearing or not no. and texture is definitely light it's not really air light as it mentions in the packaging but maybe because I have dry skin and it is also a little bit drying that's why I am feeling this foundation on my skin but apart from that this foundation is a really good foundation if you are oily skin I will again say go and grab this foundation this might become your holy grail foundation but since this foundation does not give as much of a coverage on the skin as I said this foundation is more of light to buildable medium coverage so this will be perfect for everyday use for those girls who are really oily and yeah that is all about my review onto the new Laurel Paris Infallible Pro Matte 24 hour foundation I really hope you guys have found this video helpful if you did please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you soon in my next video till then take care bye guys